Good morning. It's so good to be sharing these messages with you. Thank you for your support, your encouragement and prayers. The past three days we focused on the story of Jesus going to the disciples caught in a terrible storm on Lake Galilee. Today we consider another of those lists, which though simple, are also profound. Today's list is especially for the housewife, or should I say the home executive, but it applies in no uncertain terms to all of us. It is called Weekly Chores. Monday, Wash Day. Lord, help me wash away all my selfishness and vanity so I may serve you with perfect humility throughout the week ahead. Tuesday, ironing day. Dear Lord, help me iron out all the wrinkles of prejudice I have collected through the years so that I may see the beauty in others. Wednesday, mending day. O oh God, help me mend my ways so I will not set a bad example for others. Thursday, Cleaning day. Lord Jesus, help me to dust out all the many faults I have been hiding in the secret corners of my heart. Friday, shopping day. O oh God, give me the grace to shop wisely so I may purchase eternal happiness for myself and all others in need of love. Saturday, Cooking day. Help me, my Saviour, to brew a big kettle of brotherly love and serve it with the clean, sweet bread of human kindness. Sunday, the Lord's Day. O oh God, I have prepared my house for you. Please come into my heart so I may spend the day and the rest of my life in your presence. I'm sure Brother Lawrence, the saint of the kitchen, practiced all these weekly chores. I recommend to you his little booklet entitled The Practice of the Presence of God. Let us pray. Thank you, Lord, for these little yet vital reminders that enable us to be constantly aware of your presence in whatever situation we may find ourselves. Keep us ever sensitive, aware, and open to your help and guidance day by day. Amen. And now may the peace of God which passes all understanding keep your heart and mind in the knowledge and love of Christ Jesus. Amen. Amen.